22 is in the ground and now we're on to 23 man michael jordan year mj year baby 22 taught me so fucking much and i can't be more thankful for this year man like literally this year was life-changing in so many aspects when it came to myself when it came to my business when it came to tapping in with myself and going deeper because i was fucked up last year i was so fucked up my porn addiction was getting out of control i had no purpose whatsoever and 11 months later because it was like a month after my birthday that i started to actually make that change invest into a coach show me the program that i teach now and changing so many fucking lives like and including myself, of course, every single day. And I know 1% better every single day is the mission. So ever since that day, which was July 27th, uh, 2022, up to now, you know, today's June 19th. Today's my birthday. So do the math. It's, a, it's almost, it's about 11 and a half months of just like pure fucking consistency every single day, discipline top notch and and this year has just been crazy in so many aspects for myself and man i would have never thought in just a short time frame that i would be on this fucking park bench just really taking it all in and and you know everything just going the way as planned and i'm just truly forever grateful for everything that i do and how everything is turning out and just my perspective, because I used to be a negative bullshit motherfucker all the fucking time. I used to complain all the time. I used to be a little bitch all the goddamn fucking time about things. Now I'm not like that. The confidence I have now in not even a fucking year is astronomical. It's fucking crazy with how I look. My physique is like totally fucking changed. I'm a whole different person. My facial structure as well, like all these fucking things, is fucking crazy all the wins that i've been stacking all the connections that i made all the um uh knowledge that i've attained just investing into myself constantly that's a, a lot of big fucking moves this year that i made was was a lot of investments into a lot of different people um and those lessons taught me to go to the fucking top individuals now because once i went to the top individuals that's when i actually got the fucking results so i made sure that the person that was actually teaching had the fucking results and was doing at an optimum level, uh, optimal level, because throughout the year I was getting hit with like I was investing into people, I was getting like some results, but not, but not like up to par of what I thought. So I really had to take that step back and realize, okay, I gotta, I gotta make the investments even tighter now. Like the same thing with my macros. Like at first you just like start putting in the macros. Then you start to dial even more to hit the protein every single day. Like if it's 160 grams you're gonna hit every day, you're gonna hit that on money. Like you're not gonna hit 158, you're not gonna hit 162. Like no, you're gonna hit it 160 for year, uh, days, months, weeks, years and years and years. Like that's what I'm saying. So it's like I was hitting the protein goal for these coaches and getting it some results, but it was like, I needed to really take that next step. And for me, that was in my business. That was uh, more just personal development. And that's the fucking crazy thing is that this shit never fucking stops. This shit is a journey. This is for life. Like literally, like all these stupid like 21 day challenges. Like what the fuck is that shit? Like you did it for 21 days. Good fucking shit. Like keep fucking going now. Like this is for life. This is not some shit you do for 20 days. Then you fall off. Like even motherfuckers who say like, oh, yeah, you're in seasons, bro. Like, you got to have your seasons. Fuck that, bro. Fuck that shit. This shit year round, bitch. Like, literally, get on my fucking level. Like, that's where I'm at already. And I'm like, it's so crazy that so quickly I was able to develop that mindset because my mindset last year was literally like sit in fucking bed all day, watch anime, watch porn all fucking day and eat like shit. That was my life. And I was trying to run my business. I was trying to do these great things. And it wasn't fucking coming to fruition at all. Nothing was coming in. Nothing was coming my way. It was because my habits were out of alignment. Wasn't taking care of myself. I wasn't in a circle of people and uh, coaches and, and having that mentorship. Having that guidance. Everybody needs that guidance. For somebody who is massively fucking ahead of you, you need their guidance. Like, you can't do this shit all on your own. You're going to crap out. Like, that's just how it is. 
And that was me. And it's just crazy this past year, what I've been able to just uh, do for myself, for my family, for my people, and just tapping in more as a fucking man. Like I got this fucking tattoo this year, man. Like this tattoo means a lot to me. The day with my family, you know, my stepmom and my dad, when they got married and we all became a family where I'm at right now. And like, it means so much. And I know that's only gonna add throughout this fucking next year that's upon us. Just more tattoos that are meaningful uh, for me and whatnot. Cause the family is everything. You know, I use what I have right now at my disposal and I, I show that everything is fucking dope out here because it really fucking is. My life is fucking dope. Like everything that I got, I'm so goddamn fucking grateful every single moment of the goddamn day. Like, I don't think you guys understand. When I wake up at 4 a.m. every single day, I am truly fucking grateful for that 4 a.m. Like on money. Like that one minute of waking up at 4 fucking a.m. And then at 4.01, I'm fucking grateful. Because I could stop at any fucking second. I can die at any second. So I know there's more in the fucking tank, though, that I know I possess. It's just levels to this shit. There's more personal development. This shit don't ever fucking stop. This shit is for life. So me turning 23 is, is a new chapter. Yes, it's fucking dope. Making tons of fucking success. A lot of moves out here. A lot of fucking big-ass moves. Even just coming this week. I got a lot of podcasts coming. I got a lot of... Um, a lot of shit in the fucking works and i'm so excited for it there's a lot like a lot of shit coming and i'm like it's just massive fucking momentum and we are the only ones that can choose to stop the momentum so i know if i stop right now everything is go i'm going to a cardboard box like don't even watch me anymore don't don't fuck with me chicks that are watching this don't don't date me like i know i'm handsome but like do not date me if if like you know like everything's going to shit like for myself like what the fuck like it's like anything like that is gonna is gonna fuck you up so that's 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 what i always think of it as as this is just another day too and it's always a reset at zero we can always fuck up the day or we can make it the best day possible so i'm just I'm just blessed, man. I'm blessed for the life that I have. I'm blessed for the new chapter. And that's what 22 taught me is uh, the never satisfied mentality. A lot, a lot of mindset. Really opening up my mindset 100%. And then the way I look now, the way I operate, the the wins I stack every single day, the, the diet that I do every single day. I don't feel like a slob anymore. I don't feel like shit anymore. I don't feel weak as a man. I feel confident. I feel dope. Like all these fucking things. And I'm just like taking it all in. It's a beautiful, like usually on my birthday too, it always just feels like another day. Today feels like another day, but it feels like a special day for me. And I haven't been able to feel that in a very long time. But I'm like, yo, because I'm in true alignment, it feels special for today. It's like, yo, Nick. You're fucking killing it. So it's like you're being recognized for the wins of what I've been doing. But also it's like, okay, you still have to do what you got to get done. So I'm still hitting my non-negotiables today. Still doing my daily process. See my IG. I'm up at 4 a.m. today. Read my book. Did that. Did my macros. Like everything going in. This shit is a nonstop cycle and never satisfied. And I just know I'm the best me. And I'm always working on becoming a better version that 10.0 me every single fucking day and just providing for my people and providing out of love and uh abundance and all these fucking things and not limiting myself that's another big thing and just getting out of my comfort zone that's another big thing there's some other shit uh that i've been doing and that was on some other big things for myself and then definitely more this year is to focus on just more growth overall obviously and also more out of the comfort zone more tapping into myself it's literally the same script um and then just making more power moves that's it power moves for myself more collabs um like with uh other people in the industry and also po more podcasts more more just uh 
big moves. That's what I'm talking about for 23. And I'm just grateful for every single goddamn one of you. And just grateful for the life I truly live and everybody in it. And we're just going to keep continuing the journey. This shit don't ever stop. That's, it's just through the perspective that I see it. So it's all a win at the end of the day. 23, baby. 22, thank you so much. I love you, 22. We going on to 23, though. And 23 is here. And it's going to be fucking dope. I already fucking know. It's going to be a fire one. It's going to be a fire year. And it's just massive moves coming. That's it. Speaking to existence, baby. And it's going to be it. It's going to be it. Is it. Like, you know what I'm saying? It's just more work. It's just this shit don't ever fucking stop. And never satisfied. This shit never fucking changes. And just more growth every fucking day. That's it. Grateful for it. Grateful for everybody. And got nothing else really to say. That's what, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? There's, there's nothing else at this very moment. It's like, and we just go back to work. That's it. There's nothing else. 23. But thank you guys. Subscribe to the channel. Keep it moving. IG, Nick Drivers Fit for coaching. Get you fucking going. Change your fucking life. I did it in 11 months, man. Shit's fucking possible. You can do it in three, six, nine. It's a, it's easy, man. Once you have the fucking blueprint, DM me on IG, Nick Drivers Fit. We'll get you going ASAP. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.